What is up guys, Jeremy here and welcome back to another jailbreak update video. I'm sure a lot of you are very curious, where is Check Rain? It was said to come out today and it was supposed to. Unfortunately, it still has not been released. You can go ahead and jump to the Check Rain website. As you guys can see, it still is the same as it has been since it's been created. It just says ETA soon. So now, like I said, the jailbreak was supposed to come out today. We can go ahead and jump into some images here. These are from Twitter. And as you guys can see, uh, it started out with Jake James saying, according to my local weather, it's predicted to rain in about 20 minutes. So if you guys didn't know, Luca Tedesco is the uh, developer be behind Check Rain. Uh, it is not just him. There is a whole team of guys that are working on this. So keep that in mind as well. It's not all just him, but there is quite a few of them that are working on this jailbreak. But as you can see, he said rain delayed, but forecast still seems good for today. Now, unfortunately, this is coming from Korea. And as you guys can see, these were tweeted out at 1.39 a.m. my time and then also 3.02 a.m. Um, and I am in New York, so my uh, my time zone is Eastern. So luckily, it is 8 o'clock here right now. And the day is not over yet, so hopefully we can see this, but uh, as you can see here, even Pwned Own replied to these tweets, and he says, The best bugs are the ones that appear 15 seconds before the release and break the plans. Source, myself. Release of Uncover version 3.0.0 beta 29 with initial iOS 12 support and pretty much every other major release I have made. So, uh, basically... Stuff like this happens, guys. Um, they don't want to send out a jailbreak utility that is going to mess up your device, force you to restore, and just be a plain old big headache for you. They want to release something that's stable, going to work, and allow you to jailbreak and install tweaks and themes and everything else that you guys like to do when you're jailbroken. So keep it in mind, uh, they are working on it. It will come out. It might not come out, you know, today yet, and in at least uh, the United States time, um, but it is coming. They are working on it. They're hard at work right now trying to uh, get it 100% stable, and that is awesome to know. So just be patient, guys. Check rain is coming, and it's going to be absolutely epic. If you guys are just now tuning in and you don't know about check rain, basically it's a boot ROM-based jailbreak, or it's running off of a boot ROM-based exploit, that allows everything iPhone 10 and older to jailbreak. And the beauty of it is it's hardware based and it does not have to be on any version of iOS. It can jailbreak anything Apple throws at it basically. Uh, since it is a hardware based jailbreak, there is nothing Apple can do to fix it. So that basically means the iPhone 10 is probably gonna be jailbreakable until at least I would say iOS 16. And that is absolutely incredible. Uh, like I said, this is like a old school jailbreak, like Red Snow and all that. So it's a, it's a hardware based and it's pretty insane. Now, another thing I wanted to add here is Jamie Bishop. This is another de uh, developer that is working on the Check Rain jailbreak. Um, as you guys can read with these tweets here, uh, unfortunately, Check Rain is only going to work on Mac. Uh, it will not work on Windows, at least upon initial release. Now, I'm sure they will update it and work for it to work on Windows, but when they first release it here, it will only work on Mac, uh, and it will not work on a virtual machine on Windows. So if you have a virtual machine that you can run Mac, that will not work. It literally has to be a Mac or a Hackintosh. And uh, I personally have never done a Hackintosh, uh, and I know that it's incredibly involved to do that. So uh, like I said, guys, if you're with Windows, just be patient. You will get support eventually. You just got to wait for these guys to develop it and update it. So keep that in mind. This this uh, jailbreak will only work on Mac upon its first release. Um, and then they will work on Windows support. Uh, another cool thing here is some images of Luca at the POC event that he went to, which is Power of the Community. Uh, and if we zoom in here, as you can see, their little slogan there on the bottom of POC is Hack. For security, uh, Check Rain was due to be released at the end of this event. 
and uh, unfortunately there is a delay so it has not been but uh, it's cool seeing these screenshots of Luca giving a presenta uh, presentation about jailbreaking uh, future plans here I don't know if I can zoom it in enough if you guys can actually see it in video but uh, it's very cool to see uh, these images of Luca holding um, you know this presentation at this event about jailbreaking uh, that is super exciting um, but like I said guys check rain is currently delayed uh, just be patient it is coming it might still come tonight yet we don't know we don't know what the issue is with it but like I said I would rather um, be more patient and get a very stable jailbreak that's not going to screw up my devices then for them to rush it out and it messes things up so uh, I am thankful that they are taking their time to make sure that we get a very stable and useful utility upon release. Uh, so it is coming, guys. As soon as Checkering comes out, of course, I will have it covered here on the channel. Um, and that's basically all I got for this jailbreak update, guys. I guess I could add for anybody that's on the iPhone um, the iPhone XS Max or newer, so iPhone XS, or iPhone XS, XS Max, XR, the iPhone 11s. Uh, if you guys are on iOS 13.1.3 and you want to avoid updating, what you can do is go uh, to this website here. This is beta profiles. And what you can do to stop getting updates on your device is install tvOS 12 right here, the download. Uh, so what you do is you go ahead and download this profile, install it, and you will not get over-the-air updates on those devices any longer. So this is an incredibly useful tool to have if you guys want to block updates uh, like I said, there was a a vulnerability found in everything that is iOS 13.1.3 and below. So it goes from 13.1.3 down to 12.4.1. Uh, so if you're on any of those firmwares or in between, uh, stay there. Like I said in a previous jailbreak update video, stay there. Um, there is a vulnerability and there could be a jailbreak coming for the newer devices on those iOS versions. And the way you're going to block the updates is with this and all you got to do is click on download and then just go through the process of installing that profile and you won't have to worry about your device updating on you uh, but that's all i wanted to cover in this video guys i hope you guys are as excited as i am for check rain it's going to be an absolutely epic jailbreak it's going to open the horizons in the jailbreak world uh, but anyways if you guys enjoyed this video definitely throw me a thumbs up that helps me out a lot here at the channel and if you guys want to see more videos like this in the future don't forget to click that subscribe button. This has been Jeremy, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Later.